Hello guys, Retail here, and this is yet another tutorial of mine. In this video, we're gonna talk about how you can, after you made uh, your own textures, uh, uploaded them into Frosty, how you can later edit those uh, kits in game and see how they look. So, if you followed uh, my tutorial so far, you saw that I made these kits. And if we go to the kickoff, we're gonna be able to see how the kit looks. There we go, looks pretty dang good. And that's the reason why I make mini kit, so it so it so it comes there. Um if you're changing home away third kit, four kit, you can do that in here. But I would usually recommend if you're changing home and goalkeeper kit to do that in edit real player. Which you, you can find in customize edit real player go to the England Chelsea we can edit zoom I suppose because he has a real face you're gonna need uh, Aranactus uh, live editor for this I'm using version 20.1.3.8 pretty sure versions 0.7 and 0.6 had all this as well you want to do teams editor and then you go to the home kit because we're changing that now i've got a lot of questions about this in um, on both youtube and on uh, in discord you know those colors uh, when you play a game and there's like a scoreboard and then uh, next to your name it shows the colors so for example, Chelsea home kit is blue, but say you have like black and white and you make that kit, you, you, you would want that it shows black and white. So you change that here. You just change the RGBs of that. And you can even add the percentage. You should usually leave it at 98 or 96, it's fine. So leave that as it is. So just change RGB. So you do that here. And then you can change the jerseys and the shorts as uh, obviously no. So we see Kurt Zuma and then we see on his shorts his number is white. I would love to have that in same color as um, as the socks and uh, cuffs or and the um, color on his jerseys, no? And same on his name at the back. So how you do that? I'm gonna use the same RGB code. And that's 184, 143, 79. So I'm just gonna open Live Editor. And then we're gonna go to Jersey first. And here we can do a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. You can see like different fonts that you, that you can change. Um, you can change colors, say you want to use, I don't know, 8. So you apply changes, you go up and down, so, it, so you see the color changed. So that's how you change color, but in my case I'm using 7. Then you can make jersey like super slim or, you know, shape style, I should leave it at 0. But most important for you to change this color and um, font if you want. Uh, no, f I'm pretty sure there's no list for font. So pretty much go to the team that you like font uh, from and then you pretty much just uh, copy those numbers and use it. Simple as that. Um, now sometimes uh, if you want to remove, for example, here, you have an uh, option to show jersey at front as well. If you want that, you just press 1, and if you don't want it, you, you, you just leave it at 0, no? Then we go here. We want to change jersey number color 1. So we use that RGB provided, so we are typing 184. 143. And the last 79, then you see that uh, the color changed. 
so that's for the number that's like the main color uh, jersey number color two is like the color around it so we can maybe use um, so uh, so i'm pretty sure jersey number color two is like for like around the number or some lines in the number that usually has and uh, jersey number color three is for this it's really small but i think you can see it for like premier league logo in there inside the number so that's for that so i'm just gonna pick uh, the same codes from that i have on the kit which is 27 27 27 27 27 if you want to have that same color you 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 just use same uh, rgbs from a jersey number color one and for the name i want to be same so i use 184 143 79 i think i messed up something oh yeah i think uh wait i think this is it let me see i think this one is still bugged because it was bugged before but i guess uh, uh still not fixed let me try again 184 143 because you see i i type but the color is not like that so you can use i suppose this other part of live editor a bit trickier to change that specific part you want to go to the team kits uh you want to go to jersey to, to rest and then you go to the jersey name color and even here is messed up because it's usually rgb but here is rbg so we type 184 i type 184 double click 143 no we need to type 79 first and then 143 there we go now we can remove this side okay we can minimize this okay and then we can apply changes i think it bugged out because i used two different uh, interesting oh I, i'm an idiot i didn't change uh, shorts yet the so for the sh so i just changed jersey for the shorts you use the same thing no what was it again um 184 143 143 79 79 triple 27 27 27 27 27 27 apply there you go you see it changed now we can open it uh, to see if the name changed as well it did indeed let's try to zoom in a bit so we see the socks looking pretty dang good we can even see the shorts the logo and uh, and the shorts but for example sometimes you see like the number is almost touching the nike but sometimes it's like touching or like really up or way to down and then you change hotspots i'm gonna show you guys in the next video how you can do that if the numbers are messed up then you see this uh, hyundai as well is in there that we change the color so it's the same color as the kit and i mean the kit looks really good 
there we go that's how you edit kit in game pretty much so yeah and then you have to do any other kid you made you have to do the same things unless you're happy how it looks already so yeah let me just see so yeah, simple as that guys not really hard thanks so much for watching this video don't forget to like subscribe to me on youtube and share this video uh join my discord Follow me on Twitter and Twitch. All the links are down below. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. And the next tutorial I'll be doing is how to change hotspots and then how to make a mod and update it. Then short break and after that I'm gonna make uh, how to add an extra kit and FIFA or edit current FIFA kids. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.